Okay, guys, welcome back. It's time for episode five. Five, yes, five. Five. I'm tired. Leave me alone. Uh, good news is, uh, Minecraft got updated to 1.6.2 and Optifine has kept up. So, look, we have Zoom again. Get the binoculars out. I'm sure, Ben will get that reference. Uh, so, yeah, last time. Ooh, hello. Sun going down. It'll be asleep soon. Uh, let's just get my <coughs> get my video settings back up. Graphics, fancy details. Blah, blah, blah. I leave clouds off. It's a lot easier to see. Da, 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 da. Render distance. Extreme. And uh, far is good enough. <laughs> hey, 120 would be nice. Let's put it on max. It's going to restrict to 30, I'm sure, because of fraps. Right, done, done. Back to game. Can only sleep at night. Right, quick sit rep. Things are happening. I nearly died last night. And now we have pigs. And I should have some glass somewhere. Yes. Oh, jeez, pig. Oh, no, a pig's gotten out. Need to get him back into the pen. Sorry, piggy, this is going to hurt you. That's for your own good. Okay, note to self, don't do that again. And this way, I can see mobs coming. And I don't need to keep opening the door. Thankfully, mobs don't actually know how to use windows, so they can't see you through them. It's not very symmetrical, but I don't care. Yeah, there's more pigs out there. Okay. That's at least somewhat symmetrical. Okay, and hopefully, time to go to sleep. Because I would like to survive as long as I can, and that usually involves not gimping myself. So, anyway, the plan will be... Get them pigs to breed a bit more. And get back down in the mine, and try and find some more funky stuff. Yeah, just reorganizing my inventory up. I should keep the bow out. I don't need, really need the axe when I'm down in the mines. Okay. Let's check on the carrot farm. Sit rep. No carrots. Okay. Back down we go. Oh yeah, this is where the creeper nearly killed me yesterday. Was it there? Oh no, it was there. One, one tried its best there and failed. Uh, I think I'm getting some input lag again. This does not bode well. Hey, seeds, come here. I need seeds. Okay, ooh, yeah. It's kind of going. John complained of something like this. His mouse, ooh, hi, skeleton. His mouse kind of goes funny. When he's recording, he's getting some lag. I may turn some detail down again. I may turn it back down to f fast graphics. 
All it really does is get rid of some of the transparency effects. Hey, there was some iron I missed. I can hear a skelly. Which is a noise I don't like hearing. Ceiling iron, right. So, yeah, so today's mission, we must go deeper. I think it was this way. Ooh, might be worth getting some flint if I can. No flint so far. One bit of flint. Flint is useful. Well, not just for flint and steel, but for making arrows. Oh, hi, zombie. Is it me, or do you sound a lot more sinister than I? Stupid, stupid face, come here. Man, you take a lot of hits. Ooh, what are you? Water. You are that area I blocked off. Yes. Do you go anywhere nice? You go to iron, and you continually go down. Dirt. So I remember that there might be a possible decent area to go to next. Okay. Okay. There goes my depth perception. Really not sure what's the best way to go. I'm gonna keep going this way. Okay. I suppose another advantage of all this caving is you save on tools. Okay. Well, there's definitely something down there. Get all this coal. Ah, it's a creeper. Four arrows. Not enough to kill it, but it's enough to get a damn good head start. I didn't make any more torches. That was a failure on my behalf. Okay, now I have more torches. Two creepers. Let's... Okay, so one of them's dead. This guy can't really come towards me because of the water. Okay. If in doubt, let them take care of themselves. Bloody bat scared me there. Come here. Creepers seem to come in greater numbers in this difficulty mode. Maybe the game's freaked out because I told it to go for max 
FPS. Let's put the 120 limit back on it. The pitiful notion that this will ever run at 120 frames per second for me. Again, still no F3, so I have no way of knowing how far down I am. Or really, which way we are going. What the? Okay. Zombie quite close. Should probably have taken some of those planks with me. In all honest in all fairness. Made some sticks. I didn't really foresee a need to. No idea what time it is upstairs. Is that the same bat or is that another one? Does it avoid my torch of death? Good news is when it comes when I finally get an enchanting table, I'm going to have lots of levels to spend. On my first enchantment, I hear water. Don't know if you guys can hear the water. It's been brought to my attention that I breathe very heavily. I said it's been brought to my attention. It was brought to my attention a long time ago. And I've not really been able to do much about it. I've tried adjusting mic sensitivity, etc. I'm going to try and breathe through my nose a lot less in these videos. I realized I got no idea when I started this recording. I think it was at 10 There's a definite zombie around somewhere, and I think it's to my right, through there. So let's avoid that for now. I definitely have. I just realised I made so much iron, and I've not made any new tools or armour with it. As the saying goes, I am not prepared. Oh, hi, zombie. Two zombies. You will fall. Creeper on a skelly. Listen here. Had enough of your kind. I don't take kindly to your type around here. Yeah, I'm racist against skeletons. What you gonna do about it? So many torches. So many torches, these aren't torches. These are coal blocks. This pickaxe is not going to last much longer. Okay. So after a slight distraction, we're still only at diamond level. Oh, diamond level? That's how tired I am. I'm confusing my iron and my diamond. Okay, you may get an extra special long episode today for this episode 5, because I can't remember when I put when I started recording. So I'm going to assume I've been recording for 7 minutes, which is 21.07. I'm going to keep, go, keep this episode going until half past. That bat's annoying, it keeps flying in front of me and cancelling my block breaking. I bring a furnace? I didn't bring a furnace, but I brought a crafting bench. Okay. I think it's time to start getting tooled up again. Oh, 
Okay. So this is all pretty much explored and safe. Ah. Okay. Crafting table. That. Take two for an eye. Two for an eye! As opposed to a two for an eye. Two arrows from my bow. That's pathetic. Okay. Gotta remember where this area is. Gotta remember to come back to it. Now, I need to keep going down. Well, there's definitely something ahead. Hi, Gravel. Okay, time for the old... <laughs> quickly get rid of all the gravel trick. Oh, hello. That explains where they are. Cover that up and retreat. That's another way to explore very soon. But I think I should probably make my way back up above ground once this iron's done. Plenty of iron there. Let's make some bootsies. Nearly done. I mean, there's no excuse now for me to be just rocking stone tools now with all this iron. Ooh, they'll slow down. Take my two for an eye. Let's see if I remember how to get my way back. That staircase is a good bet. Yes, I do. Ooh, I'm getting hungry. Please, please be night time. Or night time? Daytime. Daytime. Night time. Anything spawning in there. <laughs> Looks daytime ish. No, it's not, it's night time. Damn, that is misleading. It's the middle of the night. I could run to the house and risk a zombie battering in the door. I appear to have gone unnoticed. This is a victory. <laughs> yeah, last time I did that, didn't go so well. Hi, pigs. Great, that's all I need is bloody mobs burning on top of my farm. Right. Wood. Going to get some more planks at some point soon, I guess. Right.
Okay. Mushroom can go in there for now. You can go in there, you can go in there. Actually, you can come back out. That skeleton has protected itself from being burnt by being very sneaky. It's wood gathering time. Okay, it's going to be a two front of assault. Because this guy has armor. Ooh, he can't hit me like that. Ah, oh, piss. Creeper. Come on, come on, shoot the creeper. I dare you to try. Another creeper. I ain't afraid of you. Maybe a little. Yeah, you dropped a hat. Oh, cute. Ah, do the hell. A little bug there. The uh, I know you turn passive during the day, but I don't really don't want you messing my stuff up during the night. So yeah. Bit of a pin cushion. What the? Did I pick up those seeds? Okay. Do better quality tools increase my chances of picking up seeds? I really don't know. All I know is that I went and picked up seeds and I don't actually need any. What I actually need. Carrots. Need to pick up all these carrots. And plant more of them. Damn it. Some of my grind has become unhone. Unhone? Is that a word? Unhone? I don't know. I don't care. Seeds. I'm gonna keep them for chickens. I'm gonna try and see if I can get some chickens so that I have feathers. Springs. Feather caps are useless at the moment. A lot of flesh. A lot of inventory management going on here, and for that, I almost apologise. Almost. Bone meal. Right. It's up to tree land. I should probably plant some saplings next time I get some. Yeah, on fancy graphics, you can only see through the leaves on the trees. Not on fast. A lot of big trees here. If you let the trees naturally decay, you have a better chance of getting saplings and apples. I think. I might be wrong about saplings. Kind of surprised that there's no chickens around. Normally, you see a huge amount of them. That's a lot quicker anyway, with the iron axe. That's probably enough. Matt, Matt. Okay. Don't really want 
cactus and has absolutely no value. Except maybe a defensive perimeter. Is that clay? Sun's going down already. Jeez. No, it's just cobble and surface coal. Chickens. And I didn't bring my seeds with me. Of course I didn't. See if I can get some from nearby. My god, there's a weird rend bit of rendering going on here. There's some seed. There's some seed. Ooh, hey squids. Squidlings. Chicken. Chicken. Look, look. Delicious tasty seed. Delicious tasty seed. Cluck, cluck, cluck indeed. Cluck, cluck, cluck. Cluck, cluck, cluck. Any more of your kind around here? No, but there are some caves. Do you guys get lost? Okay guys, I kind of need you to be a little bit better at following. Okay. Seriously, guys, it's not hard. They've broken the chicken's pathfinding or something. Ah, one guy. I would like to do this before the sun goes down, guys. You know what? Can't even see. Well, I can't see the house. I'd be surprised if any of these guys are alive coming back. You know what? Let <laughs> me just try and get a leash and leash the chickens over because you guys. Are impossible to work with. Seriously. Come here. Oi. Come in. Right. Jesus. Okay, and I'm really not interested in getting in any more fights right now. So to bed I go. Ah, oh, man. So the story so far. Ah, oh, there he is. Chickens. And pigs. Probably need a bigger pen for those guys, that's probably buttering on animal cruelty.
probably not enough fence. You use up a lot of sticks to make some fence. Keep forgetting just how many it takes. One chicken has all of that to roam in, and these guys are just stuck here. I got dirt on me. Yes, I do. more room to room. Let's just increase your size up there yeah, so you can walk around freely. Honestly, I'm done with the chickens. I know I need the feathers, but I just, I cannot be bothered right now trying to lure any more of these stupid bastards over. I am done with chickens. For now. For now, chickens, you are safe. At least until I can find a leash. And just pull some of you back. Or at least find one of you that's not so damn far away. A little bit of exploring. Not too much, don't want to go too far. I think we're in a plains biome here. Ah, oh, yes, remember down there. That was the other way into that area. There's water nearby. Water can sometimes signify the presence of chickens. There's a lot of pigs. No point using up any tools doing this. Coming up on midday. Ooh, getting some input lag. Hardly getting any. Okay, ooh, hi. See, you always look so much deeper. I don't know what's going on. But it's just all these all these damn render errors. It's not any of that, so maybe there is some detailed settings somewhere. That was fun. Do it again! Do it again! Definitely not luring any chickens back from over here. Way too far. Can I just make a chicken pen out in the middle of nowhere? Saddle. Damn it. A whole field of horses. Really doesn't like me. Oh, a little foal. Thanks to the render error, I can see there's lava in there. Do I have my bucket? I don't have my bucket. 
And how do they go get it? It's an interesting rock formation. Okay, so the lava is actually pissing out of the side. And it's only just spawned. Lovely. Ow, I was stupid. Okay, interesting chunk rendering there. Again, lighting errors. Some iron. And some water. Behaving weirdly. Oh, hello. Now you've updated. Gonna go kill some squids. Get some ink sacks. So that I can dye things and write in some books. I think I need this to write in books. Don't die, don't die, don't die. Ah, I'm shallower than I thought. I saw a snow biome there. Sun's beginning to go down. Well, at least I know there's horses over this way. Which is nice. Oh, Windows update, go away. Again, getting some input lag. My input lag keyboard locking locked up there. That's getting really irritating. Just doing it again. Input lag. I don't know if something on my computer is updating or the hardware is just crap. Probably a little from column A, a little from column B. If I'm really honest with you. Right. And so we are now coming up to the end of episode 5. I'll have to make my way back for episode 6. But episode 6 will be another time. When you rejoin the action, I will probably be over in the house. See you, folks.